so here we are uh, again in the iPad I'm gonna show you an app called Sunvox which um, I think is dope I think it has some crazy tight synthesizer sounds in it um, even though you can sequence whole songs in here drums half samplers the whole nine but I just use the synthesizer so I'm gonna show you some of those And the, the visualization, visualization you get in this app is pretty tight. Um, you really got to see it on the iPad since apps like these don't record on the, um, the viewer that goes onto the computer for some weird reason. But um, yeah, so this is one example of how the sense might sound and the effects even though this is a techno song right show you another example has a really long intro but um you can really hear i think the power of the synth in this song right here i'm just gonna skip ahead It's pretty tight. I'm gonna show you one more demo. Um, has one, two, three, four, five, seven demos, like full demos, and then it has simple examples. Uh, has a lot more of those. Um, I don't know. I had to guess maybe 40 simple examples or templates to start off with. But I'm gonna just show you one more example one more demo song Skip ahead a little bit, a little more. Sounds tight. It sounds tight. After YouTube encodes it and all that, it might sound not as good but um, it's tight if you have an iPhone or iPod I don't even know if you can get this app but if you could I wouldn't recommend it because even on an iPad there's so much going on that things are already kind of squished and squeezed in to um, even the iPad so uh, but basically let me just load up a new song to show you how it works um, it's just real simple from generator to effects to your output right so I'm just gonna select this echo that's defaulted on there and delete it all right now I'm a generator even though I press notes and I can see something that's going on inside of it I don't hear anything I have to with two fingers click on it and then drag to the output so then a line is now connecting it to the output, so. And I can resize my keyboard up here if I want. You just drag around to resize stuff. All right, so when my generator selected here on my left side, I see all the properties for my generator are 
if I hadn't affect the effect properties and whatnot, right? So that's one, one type of oscillator. And then another one. Yeah, so you can go through your different oscillators here, your main volume, your panning, your attack, release, um, and whether it's polyphonic or not, um, your mode, sustain, modulation, and duty cycle, which I'm really not sure about what that does yet, but if I go up really high, seems to put more of a ringing sound on it and um, there, there's like hundreds of duty cycles so I, I'm, I'm really not sure what they do though so um, yeah that's basically how, how it works you can add a new synth and select from a FM synth a regular generator like what you just saw that I had you can have a kicker a multi synth a sampler and a spectra voice which sounds really cool it's kind of like a voicey synthy ghostly type of thing and then effects you have a DC blocker delay distortion echo EQ filter go down on the list here um, after filter flanger LFO loop reverb vocal filter and vibrato um, so you, you pretty much have a lot of different scents in here and effects to put on it um, like I said you can build whole songs with drum loops and things like that but I just come in here grab the different synths from the FM to the generators and just build the synth and play it along with my real song in my Pro Tools or, or Fruity Loops or whatever like that so definitely worth checking out uh, this is Sunvox and that's my review alright